All right, let's unbox the three liter crank adapter kit from Metric Mechanic. I already cheated, I, I pulled it out, but I, I just wanted to show the packing materials and how well it was packaged from them. So you have a bubble mailer, and then it was very carefully wrapped in a bubble wrap casing with lots of tape, and uh, it was really well put together. Here's the metric mechanic tape that they use for it right here. So I'll bring this up to you guys. So, looks like they have a nice, uh, they have a nice heat shrink uh, packager. Anyway, let's jump into it. So the very first thing you see, which I believe is the um, the exact same thing you would get from a factory motor on an M54, is this bolt. So they give you a zinc plated, brand new crank bolt, and then let's jump into this. go so there's the zinc plated crank bolt washer this is how they come from the factory you'll notice there's a difference between the m20 and the m50 or m54 uh, in length um, and i can show you that in another part of the video but that's what you get there and then this really right here is what you're paying for because this you can find with the motor typically, in my experience. But this guy right here is the crank spacer, the actual part that you need. And in another video, I can show you where it goes. So it's very well coated in oil. My hands are very oily right now. Um, but you can see all the bevels. Looks like the machining is really well done and that's about it honestly looks good and really all this does is extends the surface for the seal on the front of the crank i will go show you that in just a minute but uh, this sits on the front of the crank and gives a, a surface for the front main seal to ride against because on an m20 crank this is built in so You'll have the counter, you know, the, the first counterweight on cylinder one, and there's just a, a, a machined piece like this that steps down and goes into the nose of the crank. Well, that's missing on uh, M50 and newer vehicles with uh, M50 engines. It's just the same size of the crank all the way to the from the uh, from the counter balance all the way to the front of the crank. So you got to slide this on. Uh, for it to seal on an M20 engine. Obviously the M50s, they were made differently, so this, this isn't an issue, but the whole reason you're buying this is to make a three liter or 2.9 uh, M20, and that's what you get right there. I think this was about 150 bucks on eBay. Uh, a little expensive, if you ask me, for this, but uh, I don't have a lathe to make it, so. We got to do what we got to do. Thanks for watching.